Let's go ahead and take a look at the forecast for the rest of today. So uh, right now, temperatures are sitting at about 75 degrees. If we were to average all the temperatures out this morning, there it's about 75. Uh, of course, uh, if you're inland, it's closer to the low 70s along the coast upper 70s but these are the highs this afternoon i mean this is july this is what it feels like in the middle of summer that's what it's going to feel like today so uh, the highs today will be in the low 90s and if we compare this to the average well we're well above average of 86 degrees uh, for west palm beach vero beach and fort pierce and the records in the mid 90s 94 is the record high today for west palm beach not going to beat that record we're not even going to tie it but man we're getting close and it is just downright a hot wednesday make sure you stay hydrated if you're doing a lot of work outdoors of course uh landscapers and construction workers please drink plenty of water uh that he can be dangerous but hopefully we do get some relief in the form of rain we do have the chance for that this afternoon around two o'clock We'll see the majority of the showers popping up over inland areas just west of the lake and then everything is going to press on towards the east coast and through the evening hours we'll have uh, rounds of showers and a few thunderstorms embedded as well and this can last through about 7 p.m. into the tonight uh, so this is much welcome we still need the rain and also I think with uh, such hot temperatures we could use some relief uh, so rain will be welcomed a similar forecast for Thursday Friday as well in fact Friday we could see more coverage in those thunderstorms then as we head into the weekend uh, that rain chance drops just slightly but look at those highs a uh, week long into next week the upper 80s very close to 90 degree weather and then early next week good chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms so we're transitioning into that rainy season for sure